The other day in Ohio, tornadoes touched down, and this was actually here to let me know. So I was sitting there recording reviews of the TID Radio H8, which, by the way, you can view by going through my profile. And I had gotten to the section about the NOAA weather radio. Over in and as I'm pulling it up and testing it to make sure it works, it just straight up tells me, Hey, just so you know, a tornado has touched down in Wilmington. And Wilmington's not that far from where I live. So I go ahead and record the last couple clips of the video and end the video there. Me being a radio dork and enthusiast, I go in ahead and grabbed all the radios I could alongside a blanket and some water. Went downstairs. While I kept my extra radios and extra batteries over here next to my AM receiver, I went ahead and turned on my GMRS radio. And here it sat on one repeater alongside the NOAA weather radio. And on the repeater was at least 20 people sitting there listening and monitoring the frequency in case anybody was in danger. Everybody had check-ins, everybody got each other's call signs and made sure everybody was okay. And here's the thing, even though the cell phones were out, Using my GMRS radio, I was able to get a hold of my father. See, he just so happened to also be monitoring the frequency in case of an emergency. Which means I was able to make sure my family was safe and he was able to make sure that his family was safe. Ultimately, we all ended up okay. And Does this seem like a little bit extra? Yeah, but does it give you peace of mind? Of course. And I think it just kind of adds the reason why you should have an amateur and a GMRS radio on standby at all times.